here for the fashion culture welcome or welcome back to my channel if you haven't subscribed already please do so and don't forget to hit the bell notification so you won't miss out on upload period thank you guys so so much for 7,000 subscribers I truly appreciate any and every one of you I know some people were like girl it's only 7,000 but truly and honestly literally anybody that supports me means the world to me you are helping me reach a goal and you're helping me to keep going and telling me that you like my content and that means a lot to me. So I kind of figured out what my niche is on YouTube. You guys love my Boss Babe series and you love my nail videos. So I thought I would do an inventory haul showing you guys all my new inventory for my business. Um, if you guys are not aware, I have my own cosmetics company called Lash Culture Cosmetics. However, I am currently in the process of rebranding. Actually, tomorrow will be June 26th, will be my three year anniversary and will be the relaunch of my new brand which is called Lux Culture Cosmetics. You can follow us on Instagram at shoplexculture and our new website is luxculturecosmetics.com. By the time you guys will see this, everything that you're about to see in this video will be up and um, available to shop and purchase. So please go support me, luxculturecosmetics.com and at shoplexculture on Instagram. So, yeah. So let me tell you guys a little bit about the rebrand and then we're going to get into this haul showing you guys all my new inventory okay so like I said if you guys are not aware I do have my own cosmetics company selling lashes lash culture cosmetics yeah I've been wanting to expand for a really long time so my new company Lux culture cosmetics which um, it's pretty much just like an expansion of Lash Culture Cosmetics. We now offer lashes, gloss, and glitter, and we're going to keep adding products, you know, as we go on, but it's going to be an entire cosmetics company. Um, so yeah, I just really wanted to start small, so that's why I started with two more, um, collections rather than just starting up the whole, like, you know, cosmetics company. So, um, the two new products are gloss and glitter, and I want to show you guys all the stuff that I got to rebrand my um, company. Being that I'm no longer just offering lashes, I felt that it was only right to change the name of my company, you know, because it's Lash Culture Cosmetics. So I just changed it to Lux Culture Cosmetics because I actually really love the culture cosmetics. Like, it's, it's a culture, it's a lifestyle, you know, it's not just something that you buy once or twice, like, beauty and like lashes and makeup and all that stuff it's a lifestyle and it's really like for girls who really truly you know love this 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 beauty industry I changed the name to Lux Culture Cosmetics um basically all I did was change the first word of the the company and I really want to show you guys all the new stuff obviously if I have new stuff I no longer can use you know the old business cards or anything because they no longer serve me so I wanted to show you guys all the new inventory I got it's definitely over like a thousand maybe two thousand dollars and yeah let's get started okay guys so I don't even know where to begin so we do offer more than just lashes now but I did want to kind of upgrade the um, lash boxes since I no longer can sell the boxes that say lash culture cosmetics if you guys are not aware um, like I said I had three different collections mink silk and 25 mm and these are what the boxes look like so this was my 25 mm box it just says lash culture cosmetics 3d luxe collection and then it says all our socials and stuff and you just pull it out and then this is our mink lash box it says premium um luxury mink lash collection whatever um and it says um i'm not perfect but my lashes are hashtag hashtag lash culture doll it has the holographic and it's like a purpley color and then i have the pink which is our silk lashes premium silk same thing I'm not perfect but my lashes are and it's holographic but it's like gold and on the back of both of those it has our social medias so yeah I honestly really love like the pink theme I love the holographic theme so I kind of wanted to stick with that but again I really wanted to like um you know just upgrade basically so I want to show you guys my new lash boxes okay so these are our new lash boxes they say Lux Culture Cosmetics and they are pink with holographic trim. I don't know if you guys can tell. And on the back it has all our socials again. So if you guys can't tell, these are paper boxes and the boxes that I used to have are like cardboard. Like they actually have like material and you can open and close them. But our new boxes are... Um, paper and the reason I did this is because I'm no longer a lash company so I felt that I did not need to spend a lot of money on the boxes because 
while my lashes still have to be quality and I still care about the you know the overall look of my brand I'm no longer just a lash company you know what I'm saying so it's not just the only it's not the only inventory that I'm offering meaning I don't need to spend as much money on just one you know um, collection of my company so I spent a lot of money on these boxes because I wanted my lash company to be a certain way you know so I wanted each of my lash collections to have a different box whereas now I have you know more than one type of product so I have lashes gloss and glitter so I don't feel the need to have to spend money on you know certain boxes because as long as the you know the boxes are quality so that's why I went with the paper boxes they are so much cheaper if you're if you want to be honest so you just open the box and then you know the lash comes out or you can pull it out or whatever <clears throat> so this is rich bitch if anybody is interested I got a hundred of those so these are all of them actually I, some of them are already um, put together some of the lashes I already started putting together so this is maybe about 75 um, and they come like this so it's so much more convenient they charge you so much shipping because they can't like break these boxes down so it comes in a huge box and it costs a lot more money to ship them over here that's what I'm saying I'm literally saving hundreds of dollars by using these boxes so I put in an order for more boxes of these already because I love them um, so yeah those are those my new lash boxes and then these are the trays that come with them um, this is about 75 too but I definitely need to order more um, although some of my lashes come with the white trays so yeah these are what I'm just gonna put my lashes on and like I was saying in the back I'm gonna include a spoolie with each order so I got these from Amazon they're just like little lash spoolies you get 300 in a pack I'm not sure how much they were I believe they're about $13 but don't quote me on them quote me on it um, and in each little packet comes 50 so I'm gonna keep them in the packets though because I don't want to like you know expose them because these are actually going to be on people's lashes and stuff like that so yeah. I'll take one out for you guys so you can see it but I'll take it off the box that I already have it so 50 in each little packet and you get 300 total super cute so yeah this is what the spoolie looks like And I'm just going to offer these, you know, sometimes your lashes get messed up and this will help you clean it and get it back to its normal shape. Okay, so moving on. Um, another thing I got for lashes were these little bags. So many people write me about these bags every day. I literally get comments like every day asking me what the plastic bags I put my lashes are called. I put my lashes in are called and they're called cellophane bags. So many of you guys ask me what these bags are called. They're called cellophane bags, you guys. I'll leave it on the screen and I'll put it down below. Um, so yeah, just look up clear cellophane bags, clear, yeah, that's what they're called. <laughs> so yeah, um, I, like I said, this is a new vendor that I was working with for the lash boxes. So usually when I get lash boxes, I always ask the vendor to put them in here or I'll pay for them, um, if they won't, you know, do it. Um, but like I said, it's a new vendor, so I forgot to ask them. So I had to actually purchase these off of Etsy. Um, if you guys are looking for business supplies, please check out Etsy. Etsy is where it's at, y'all. Etsy has so much, like, bomb stuff, literally. So yeah, it was 200 in a pack. So 200 comes in a pack, and I got the size 3 times 5 I get that comment a lot, too, because a lot of you guys know what they're called or know where to find them, but you don't know the size. Mine are 3 times 5 but I actually just encourage you to measure whatever you're trying to put it put in these bags and go by that so mine like I said are three times five but it is a little too big for my last box so I'll show you what mine looks like um, so yeah you if you have like paper boxes or boxes similar I would go with like three times five this this would probably be the perfect size for these like and even then it's still a little bit bigger but yeah three times five is the size I got but I just re recommend just measuring whatever you're using and just put it in there so this is how mine will look you know in a cellophane bag it just gives your lashes a, a more like um, luxury touch and it looks more professional so yeah okay so staying on the lash category I went ahead and re-upped on lashes so here's all my lashes it's about 300 lashes in here um, I have 15 lash styles so yeah it's just a whole bunch of lashes and like I was telling you guys some of my lashes do come with the white trays already so I just have to basically put them in the box. Some don't, so I'll just have to put them on the white tray, but that's okay. But yeah, I just have so many lashes in here. Like this is so tea. 
This is Insta Baddie. This is High Demand. This is Rich Bitch. This is Not So Basic. Um, Too Hottie. So yeah, I have literally all my lashes in here. Let you guys know, so many people ask me about my packaging, my lashes. I do sell my lashes vendor. You can email me at thefashionculture at yahoo.com. My lash vendor list is $40. It includes everything. Every company that I use for all this stuff is on there. Email me when you're ready to pay and I'll just literally email the list right to you once payment is sent. You can just say, hi, I'm interested in your lash vendor and I'll send you an email and then once, you know, I'll, once we confirm payment, I'll send the list right away. Just wanted to put that out there because I literally get emails daily from my Boss Babe series and I appreciate it so much. Um, and a lot of people will leave comments and stuff like that where you can literally just email me and we'll just make it a you know quick, fast transaction. And I've helped over 20 girls start their own company. So just saying. So moving on, um, let's get into like marketing. So the first thing I got were obviously new thank you flyers because I'm no longer a lash company. So these are my new thank you flyers. Like I said, you guys, Etsy is where it's at. So instead of paying my graphic designer to make um, thank you flyers for me, I bought a template from Etsy and I just customized it myself. I think the template was about $12 and then these were probably about um, 20 I don't know. I got 200 So I think they were about $40 to um, print out and from Vince the Print, I would have to pay my graphic designer to like make these for me when I literally just made these all myself and just got them printed on Vista print and shipped right to my house so it's just an option for somebody who you know doesn't want to pay a graphic designer but you know you're still gonna have to pay regardless so yeah these are my new thank you cards again I got the template off it um, Etsy if I can find it I'll leave it down below it says my logo so this is my new logo Lux culture cosmetics thank you for shopping with us it has our socials shop Lux culture on instagram Lux culture cosmetics on facebook and then it has our email info at luxculturecosmetics.com and then it has our website period so like all of this right here was like part of the template but like um for shopping with us like that text i added all of that i added because i wanted that certain like font so i added that myself um we love selfies obviously i put a picture of my model I did have a photo shoot recently but this is like an older picture um, so this says that we love selfies tag us at shop Lux culture tag us on Instagram and use Lux culture babe to be featured and then it gives you a um, discount code so yeah I got 200 of those and like I said they're from Vista print I think I paid about $40 for them I brought thank you flyers but I forgot to make um, business cards and then I forgot to get like postcards for like PR packages so I send out packages to influencers sometimes and I like to write notes but I forgot to get business cards and postcards um, and I just I literally just remember that today so shout out to shout out to Staples because Staples have same day printing um, and pickup so I went to Staples today and I got postcards for PR packages so I literally only got like 50 of these because um yeah I don't, I don't send out that many PR packages but um it just says Lux Culture Cosmetics and then on the back it's just plain like I said I just like to write out notes to them so I think I paid like $20 for these um really simple and easy I literally made them today and picked them up like three hours later so I think um Staples is literally the gold and usually I would like spend more time to really create so my camera died and I'm not sure if you guys can see me in the angle is good but whatever so usually I would spend like more um, time on my business cards but I really just wanted to have them because I know I get local orders and I don't like to always give them thank you cards I usually just put like a business card when it's like a local order um sometimes I do get business cards I mean thank you flyers so I just literally created these super quick I like them but I forgot to put glossy on the whole thing and I should have made them thicker but um they're cute so on this side it says Lux Culture Cosmetics, slay the Lux Culture way. And then I just have luxury gloss, luxury lashes, gloss, glitter, and more. And then I just have our socials and our website. So they're cute. You know, not the best, but they're really cute though. So yeah, I got 200 of those. So in total, I spent like $40 on the business cards and the postcards. Again, it's same day pickup, so I'm so happy about that. Shout out to Staples. I got these organza bags from um, 
from Amazon. They came 100 in a pack, but literally like over 30 of them were like damaged. So it's probably only 75 in here, but this is what they look like. I'm going to put the lip gloss orders in here and maybe the glitter orders. I'm not 100% sure. I think I'm going to use my other thing for glitter. But yeah, I'm going to put my lip glosses in here. Um, so yeah, these are what they look like. And I think I paid about $12 for 100 not sure but again I'll leave all links down below that I can find yeah I'm not sure if I'm gonna put my glitters in there but um, I know for a fact that if I don't I'll put them in these if you guys have been watching my channel for a while you guys know I had these before they're just like little holographic bags you can just put your glitter in here so um, I got a hundred of these and I think these were about 13 or 20 I mean 13 or 14 dollars as well um, so got a hundred of those and my camera keeps dying because I really don't have that much space on my memory card But another thing I got from Etsy are poly mailers. Um, I use these to put my PR boxes in. you can't find like this color pink on Amazon That's where I usually like to get them from but I found these on Etsy and honestly, they're literally the perfect color So I got again a hundred of them for like $12 um, a lot of stuff be like $12 so yeah, um I'll leave this down below but I like to put my mailers in here because I don't think that my mailers are like shipping boxes I think they're actually like good enough for people to keep and use so that's why I like to put them in something to actually ship them so yeah and again I can never find like this color pink it's always hot pink or like pink with stripes or like pink with gold and white I was super excited when I found these again guys if you're looking for bomb stuff for your business look on Etsy if you can't find it on Amazon or wherever look on Etsy. Let's get into one of the new items and like I said you guys I currently offer gloss on my website. I'm so excited! Yes finally. Okay so I've been wanting to do gloss for a really long time and I've been trying out a whole bunch of different vendors. I literally can go and get all, all the samples but the time is now. So because this is my first time I only ordered 100 glosses. I have four different shades so basically 25 glosses each and I want to show you guys my new glosses. I just had a photo shoot for them on Monday and I'm so proud of it and I love them and I got good feedback so far. So let me show you guys the four colors. Okay so this is my glam gloss collection you guys. Four different glosses. Oops, let me switch that. Four different glosses. Okay, so the first gloss we have is called Milk Marie, and Milk Marie is a pink gloss with glitter. So, they all say Luxe Culture Cosmetics on them. And it has glitter in it. The next gloss is called Saucy. So, Saucy is more like a corally color, and it has no glitter in it. They're all sheer, you guys. So, this is saucy okay so the next gloss is called iced out it looks more like nude but when you try it on it has a little shimmer to it you guys probably can't tell but I have it on right now but it kind of mixed in with my um, lip liner but I love iced out actually I love them all but this is our iced out iced out gloss and this one has glitter in it as well <sighs> obsessed and then obviously if you drop a lip gloss collection you cannot drop lip gloss without having a clear freaking gloss I mean hello so this one is called let's be clear so just a clear gloss and this is what the wand looks like you can actually see it in a clear it's so like it's a really good wand and if you have um if you have like big lips like me especially for my black girls you know with big lips this will definitely cover your lips honey I have on, like I said, I have on iced out, but I definitely have on a lip liner too. So yeah, so these are all my glosses, you guys. We're stocked, you know. Like I said, I have a hundred, but um, I just wanted to see how they do before I buy like a really like a big big order of them. So once these sell out, I'm gonna definitely place, or once they're you know starting to sell, I'm gonna place like my bigger order. But I just wanted to see how the glosses did on the site, and I'm so so proud of them. And I didn't show you guys, but they all have like the names on it. So this is iced out and like it says iced out. I don't know if you guys can see it. They 
all have their names on it. Milk Marie. Let's be clear. And saucy. guys can see that but I'm so proud of these glosses they're really professional I know lip glosses are very popular right now and I think all girls who want to start that lip gloss business start it I really tried to make like my own glosses and I was going to do it that way but I really just didn't like that approach not because um, I just didn't want to make each gloss but I just didn't really like the texture and I just didn't feel like it was like the kind of vibe I was going for like none of the formulas I tried was just working for me so I thought that it would just be easier to go ahead and do private label cosmetics and that's what I did and I'm so glad I did I found the perfect company to work with and um, you know to do my private label cosmetics for me and I'm so 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 glad that I went with them so proud that I have these glosses they are literally amazing non sticky 100% cruelty free and they're just such good glosses I swear I'm not like gassing it but so yeah, now you guys see my gloss. You can go purchase it on the website. They're ten dollars each. Y'all know me. I when I do stuff, I I I do it right. Okay. So I, a lot of people just sell their gloss like this, and I was honestly contemplating like, you know, I just have the gloss, and I was just gonna you know put them in like a, a mailer like this. I mean, an organza bag and something like this. And this still looks really really good, right? Right? It does. But guess what? Me being me, I can't. I cannot do that oh so I had to take the extra step and get lip gloss boxes made you guys you know I cannot half ass anything you know so I got lip gloss boxes made um, also from the same um, place that did my glosses so these are my lip gloss boxes oh they're so pretty so they say Lux culture cosmetics and then down here it says lip luster gloss and it just has like the, the weight or whatever and then you turn it on the other side you turn it on the side and it has the ingredients everything is in holographic text duh and then you turn it on the other side and it says made in PRC which is the Republic of China and distributed by Lux Culture Cosmetics LuxCultureCosmetics.com and it has our um, Instagram and it's cruelty free oh my god I'm just uh. And then on the other side, it says Glam Gloss because it's our Glam Gloss collection. And I am just obsessed with these boxes. Oh my God, I'm literally obsessed. So yeah, and then the last like thing about it is that I made them put like a little, I asked them to put a kissy on the top. I thought that would just be like a really cute um, little, you know, touch. So yeah, the gloss is fitting her perfectly. And when I ship them, I'm going to keep the plastic on them just as an extra little, um, extra security and you just do that and do that and boom ah, this is my gloss this is my gloss like this is my gloss this is mine like I made this I made this so yeah um this is my lashes um, I mean so these are my new lip glosses this is the glam gloss collection and then these are the boxes so, like I said, um, the company that made my glosses also made my boxes. However, they did not make my lash boxes. So, are two different colors, unfortunately, but it does not bother me at all because everything just looks quality and everything looks good. So, as you can see, um, yeah, they're two different colors. Not, not, not a biggie at all, honestly. Like, look how quality that is. How can I even be upset when this just looks so good? And they're all on brand regardless if they're not the exact same color, you know. I want it focused. Okay. So yeah, you can see that they're not like the exact same color. So on the actual glosses, they say the names of the, you know, like let's be clear or whatever. But I wanted the names actually on the box as well. So I had the Make Me Stickers. So this is like what they sent me six sheets and on each sheet you get 10 and like I said I only have um, 25 of each gloss but this is the bomb so you literally just you know take the sticker off you can see I started doing some and put it on the box I think I have some made up already let's see yeah so 
so this one is iced out and that's how it looks and then they send me these little stickers to put on top of the sticker so that they don't come off so yeah they're just like little clear stickers and you probably probably can't tell but that's what it looks like see that little like clearness that's the sticker on top of it Y'all, when I tell you these glosses are the bomb and I did that, I did that. So yeah, these are all my gloss boxes. Um, the gloss boxes are like cheaper to buy in bulk, like a lot. So I actually have a thousand gloss boxes, but only they only sent me 250. I told them to keep the rest at their warehouse. So basically when they send me my new order of glosses, they're going to put all my glosses in the box for me rather than sitting like this. So yeah, I have 250 here and then the other, what, 750? Seven. Yeah, 750 are in the warehouse. So, yeah, it was just really smart to buy them in like a lot of bulk. Unfortunately, the glosses are not like as cheap as the um the glosses are not as cheap as the gloss boxes, but but we're going to be fully stocked on glosses, you know, soon. I just wanted to make sure that the glosses sell well. So, um yeah, I'm really excited. Please go shop my glosses, you guys. Got some new mailers. So, the glosses are going to be shipped in the mailers because um, they have padding and stuff like that so basically I'm just gonna put put the glosses like with the box in or again the bag like so and ship it out in holographic mailers aren't these so cute you guys so yeah um, I didn't want to do pink again because like my a lot of everything is pink, but I have holographic accents everywhere, so I thought holographic mailers would be um, cute. Usually, I would get these from papermart.com, but when I went to papermart, this size was sold out in the holographic, or they call it iridescent or whatever. So, I went to Etsy, and I got them for like, I think it was $4 more with shipping, but listen, I'm not about to wait. Till, they told me that I wouldn't be able to get them to July on papermart, so literally, I got all of this for like... 30 or 40 dollars from um i think it was 50 with shipping so i think they're 40 but 50 with shipping and i think on paper mart i would only pay like 45 dollars so yeah i got a whole bag of these i ain't gonna pick them up but yeah so this is a hundred this is a hundred normally i would ship my lashes in um the holographic mailers too if it's under like three boxes or whatever but I'm not going to be using like the mailer boxes that much anymore like I said those are really going to be PR boxes so I wanted another kind of box but I didn't want to like spend a lot of money on getting them custom made or whatever so I bought these white corrugated boxes. so they're right here I got 50 of them and there was 50 for like $22 I got them from Amazon they're the size 6 times 4 times 3 and this is what they look like yeah, I will be shipping all lash orders in here. Obviously, if you get lashes and lip gloss, I'll ship both. But I didn't want these to be able to. I didn't want these to be able to bend in the mail, so all my lash orders will be in here, like so. Just you know, I think I could fit up to four or five pairs in here at a time, so all the lash orders will be in here. They're super small and compact and you can definitely ship them out and then I'll just put the shipping label going like this you can put the ship label just on the side but I'm going to put it going over like this so that way obviously the box won't um, come loose while while it's being shipped so I guess I should show you guys the actual PR boxes that I got so these are the new boxes obviously like I said with all my mailers I make them myself my graphic designer makes my logo but I make all my mailers myself people ask me all the time where I get these boxes from if you guys want to know you can email me I sell my vendor but I make them myself and get them printed so yeah if you guys want to know go ahead and email me and I'll, sh I'll um we can get the vendor list started so it says Lux Culture Cosmetics and then it just has our website and then it has our social media it says shop Lux Culture then you open it and it says slay the Lux Culture way and then you open it again and it says warning the items in this box will make you a baddie proceed with caution if you guys know my other boxes were so plain let me show you guys my other boxes the lash culture mailer boxes it says Lux Culture Cosmetics premium silk and luxury lashes whatever you open it oh it had lash goals on one side and then it had um live love lashes on the other and you open it and then it says our website lash culture cosmetics and you open it and it's just completely clear oh 
and like I said, I tried, y'all, I tried the whole making my own lip, lip gloss thing, TKB. It just wasn't for me. Okay, it just, it just wasn't for me. This is a sample of something I was trying, but, um, yeah, it just wasn't for me, so that's why I just went ahead and got the private label. One is a little bit smaller, and it just looks so much more classier and chic and just, ugh, I'm obsessed. But I won't be shipping out that many orders in these, only if you buy a lot, a lot of stuff from the website. Pretty much everything is going to be in these boxes or the mailers, so these ones are for pretty much exclusive orders only. They're so expensive to be made, so I'm only going to be shipping PR um, packages out in here or giveaways or just stuff that has a lot of um, items in it. Guys, some random stuff. So these little bins I'm going to use for organizing. I got these from Five and Below. They were $2.25 each, so I am going to do like an organize my whole inventory video with me that'll be up soon. Um, so you guys will see me organizing all of this stuff on my um little warehouse if you want to call it so you yeah. got two binders from walmart so this one i'm going to put um this one is going to be for inventory so i'm going to you know do like weekly inventory make sure everything's up to up to date and i just wanted something cute to put it in so i got this from walmart and this is a 1.5 inch binder and then I also got a two inch binder, really big, and I just got a white one, and this is gonna be where all my orders are. I like to print out each order and stuff like that, and just have them with me. So earlier, I don't know if you guys heard me say, but I did say that we offer glitter on the site now. So I um, had to buy some bulk glitter, cosmetic grade, of course. My glitter's in bulk, um, but only three of the colors were available, so these are the three colors that I have, and then I'll show you guys the fourth color, but it's not in bulk or whatever. My glitters are chunky, and all of them are holographic, so this is our black glitter, and we call this one Savage. So yeah, this is our black Savage glitter. This is our silver glitter, and we call this one Silver Surfer. So bomb, you guys, like get into it silver surfer i got that from um you know the kanye west album so much stuff you guys that stuff is just falling everywhere then we have a gold glitter and we call this one gold digger not gold gold digger and like i said that the, um, I don't have my bulk of the pink glitter yet. I do have my little sample one that I've been using, and this one we're calling Barbie Dreams. So, yeah, I've been testing them out. So, let me show you guys. So, like, this is, like, Savage. And this is how they're going to come. So, this is Savage. They're all just in here. These are my little testers or whatever. The glitters come like are shipped in these little holographic things, but they come in these little clear acrylic case jars. And I had to buy, you know, a lot of them because we stocked up on glitter, okay? We we stocked up on glitter. You guys can see Chanel in the back, but basically I bought 300 um of these little jars on Amazon. I think it was $45. So this is what they look like. This is 20. So you get um, seven of those boxes, and each box you get 40. Like I said, it's 300 in total, all from Amazon. So it's 20 on the top, 20 on the bottom. Yeah, I brought 300 of those, so I will be fully stocked on glitters. I'm pretty sure that each pound of my glitters can probably yield about 50 each. So it'll probably be about, I'll still have about over 100 left, but at least I'll have them, you know? Another thing I got from Etsy are just these little thank you stickers. I'm going to put these on our holographic um, mailers. They just say thank you. And they're just pink and white. I believe those were like $7.99. We're pretty much wrapping up the video, but I just got like a few random more things. Um, this is something that I've been wanting. So this is like a mini portable um, studio. And you can literally like comes with the cord and stuff and you can plug it up on the side and as you can see it has lights at the top and then it comes with six different little like backdrops that you can put in here it comes with white yellow black green um red and blue and you can go ahead and like make a little makeshift studio and then it has like a little opening at the top so you can like take your pictures so yeah this is the brand i know y'all gonna ask 
the brand. This was literally like $22 on Amazon. I have used it. Um, you do have to still edit your pictures though, so it's bomb. But um, I will probably invest in one that costs a little bit more though. Just so I can have more space to work, you know. I showed you guys my mailer boxes, but I didn't show you guys all of them. I just got 50 of those of my PR boxes, so yeah. And literally the last thing I got were just some Dymo labels. Um, I got two from Walmart. These are the clear transparent ones. And then I ordered a pack of four. They're not the Dymo brand, but they still work. Um, I got a pack of four of those from Amazon. And honestly, this is what I just used to label my lashes. And I'm also going to be using it to label my glitters. And that is it, you guys. That's all the stuff that I'm going to need to start my new business, Lux Culture Cosmetics, where I sell lashes, lip gloss, and glitter. So now, basically, I just have to organize all this stuff. I'm so, so excited. I'm so proud of myself. I really feel like my 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 vision came together, um, even though I spent a shit ton of money. I hope you guys enjoy it, and I hope you guys are able to shop the website. Don't forget to shop Lux Culture. If you have a website, if you have a business, please leave it down below. Let's support each other. If you guys have tips or advice, or you're looking for tips and advice, leave it down below. This is a boss babe community, and we're going to all get money together we all can eat together and thank you thank you so much for all the positivity you guys continue to uplift me and support me even when i don't upload and that means everything to me okay guys so that pretty much wraps up the video i am so proud of lux culture cosmetics and i hope you guys love it don't forget to shop the website and follow us on instagram at shop lux culture and also comment rate subscribe bye dolls stay fat